Hello, my name is Linda Wasselsu, also known as L.M. Wasselsu and or Professor Scry, and I'm going to tell you why I've chosen to self-publish my books. When I finished writing my first novel, I looked at all the options. I could have submitted a thousand manuscripts to publishing companies, waited for a reply, and heard nothing. That's right, nothing. In this changing world with technology moving faster than we can keep pace, a growing number of authors are turning out manuscripts. And there's no easy way to get your head above the crowd when more than 500,000 books are published annually. Agents and publishers are inundated with submissions and often announce that they're not even taking new applications. Even at that, even if they were accepting applications. There are risks in submitting manuscript after manuscript, starting with rejection, the number one way of destroying one's talent. And on top of that, there's the high cost of postage and printing. So that situation leaves the unknown author standing quite alone. But don't despair, for there are other choices which means that the author is not entirely left out in the cold. I had decided, rather than sitting on one single manuscript for years, that I'd press on. I began looking at the options. One can use a publishing agency, which is quite different than a publishing company. They will happily format and edit the author's work, create a cover, or work with the author on creating a cover, then get the book in print, all for a fee, of course. Or one can do as I have done. Write my story, create my own cover, find an editor, then publish my own book through Amazon at zero cost. If one says it quickly enough, it sounds easy. However, for me, it was a steep learning curve and it took a great deal of perseverance in order to get my first novel up for sale. Now, after p publishing a number of books, I can almost do it blindfolded. Having said that, and in all honesty, writing the book and getting it published, they're the easy parts. Marketing and getting your name out there is super difficult. Remember the sea of one half million books published annually? I'm floating in it, along with millions of other authors. However, there are a few marketing strategies that you can use. Start with a well-designed website, open a Facebook account for business, open a Twitter account, and then start blogging. Those are but a few of the key marketing strategies. And once that's done, ensure the website is up to date and make regular postings to the blog. That way you will keep your audience up to date with what you're doing and working on. One great way of building exposure is by getting people involved. Ask for ideas on Facebook, for example. Be it a part of the story, the book title, a cover design. Dream up something and people are happy to participate. You can also create a giveaway, but make them work for it. They must qualify. If it's on Facebook, they have to make a comment, share the posting, and then like your page. Then in time, you'll get your head above the crowd. The competition is tough, but remember, few of us would be doing what we are without modern technology.